love eating ass. And dick pics. And we love dick pics. We love Kiki Palmer's titties. Yes. Shout yes. out. That was my screen saver. <laughs> what do you do when kids misbehave? You call their parents. Dad! What is this? What happened to my little girl? It's really not a big deal. This is a very big deal. What's going on, folks? With nothing better to do. I'm Blogzilla. <laughs> this is kinda sorta the no judgment zone. I have the wonderful Kiersey Clemens with me. Uh, you might have seen her in Dope. She's uh, in this really funny movie that's better than the original <laughs> called Neighbors 2. Sorority Rising. Rising? Yeah. That's what's up. Did you pledge when, when you were in college? Did you go to college? No, I didn't go to college. Okay. Only one of the girls in our movie actually went to yeah. college. I was not her. Um, I don't know, college wasn't my thing. Actually, when everyone was looking for colleges, I was looking for an agent. I was yeah. starting to act, actually. But the last two years we were talking about it, it's been like really amazing for you. Yeah, I mean, like you said, being busy yeah. is always good. But I've also had, like, the beginning of this year, I've had some downtime to just read some scripts and write scripts of my own, which is really nice. But it was hard to get used to having so much free time. Yeah. How do you find the inspiration to write your scripts? I didn't know you were a writer. So. Um, well, I always wrote, the thing is, I never wrote scripts. I always wrote music mm -hmm. and poetry. And when I was younger, I think my interest for acting came from the idea of storytelling. Like, I love, I've, I love to read and I love... I don't know, I love to make up conversations, I guess. Yeah. Like, I had imaginary friends, like I was I was that type of kid. Yeah. I started doing comedy, uh, yeah. stand-up comedy. That's and not ever gonna happen for me. Jumped on stage and I killed it the first three times, like uh -huh. I killed it. Okay. And then I went on the fourth time and I told my jokes and they were just like, and it's like, what? <laughs> and it just I... was one joke, because I knew the you other jokes. You were so were... confident at that point. I was. At that point you're like, I got it, that's got never it. gonna happen yeah. to me. I feel that way. And I've I definitely bombed auditions. Really? And like, oh yeah. I like bombed one a couple of weeks ago and it's like, oh, um, it's the, you get so confident and like you feel so good in what you're doing. Like you mm -hmm. said, like you did three shows and <laughs> you just have bad taste sometimes. Or maybe it's not you, maybe it's them. It is totally them. <laughs> We're going to start a sorority. They can party the way that we want to. What's the name of our sorority? Kappa. Kappa Nu. Yeah. We are the first sorority that can party. <laughs> What is the attention like for you? Like people give you a lot more attention now. Like, do you still fly under the radar? Or are you getting a lot more attention? Um, I get like very random attention. So for me, it's always like I think a bit shocking because it really depends on like very like the demographic, like what state I'm in, where I'm at, if I'm at the grocery store, if I'm like it really really depends on where I'm going, and it can be like no attention at all, and then it can be really overwhelming. Oh, Kiki wrote on the wall, and that really just caught my eye. That's so funny. She's one of my best friends. <laughs> Kiki um, Palmer. Yeah. Yeah. Actual really personal question. It's yeah. like a creepy question. Okay, I love but that. But you, you just jumped into Kiki Palmer. Okay, yeah. Uh, did you, did you Go see her it. nudes? I do. They we leaked about on them. the internet. Yeah, I saw her nudes. What did you say to her when it happened? Because that's the most I can imagine. I mean, it's kind nude. of like to be honest, like it was for her. It was like this is she would have rather like different nudes got leaked <laughs> because for her it wasn't like oh these are my sexy nudes. We all, as girls, we all have personal pictures in our phones, you know, like, do you know how many of my friends have gotten their, like, titties pierced and sent me pictures of their boobs? Or when my mom <laughs> got her boobs done, she sent everyone pictures. Oh, wow. Like, that's what we do. Or, like, one day I'm feeling myself and I'll send a picture to my sister. Now people are going to be trying to hack me. But, like, <laughs> that's what, as girls, like... That, that's normally when you hack someone, that's what you're seeing. Right. And that's even worse than you getting a hold of like a picture that we want to send to a guy. So for her, that's where she felt yeah. invaded, which is what she will tell you. Those girls are out of control. Get away from me! They're using their sexuality as a weapon. Someone help me! Get out of here, you animals! Sexier. That's the beauty of friends and everything else, because you guys seem really, really tight on this on a set of neighbors too. Yeah, it we was are. phenomenal. Yeah, we we made a lot of great friendships on there. When you have such a big cast, you're like bound to. I hope you make a friend with somebody. Yeah. Otherwise, it's you. <laughs> yeah, I was blessed to be able to see Seth Rogen. Uh, direct and sort of mm. act, and I love the way mm -hmm. he just throws stuff out there. Yeah, that's like, very it'll much what it was. Like it'll be on paper, and then it's like, right. say this, say that, say this, say that. Yeah, when you're doing a comedy like that, the script is more of an outline, whereas with like dope, because we had to hit certain points politically, it was very scripted. But with this, it's comedy, and there's a lot of improv. There's alt. Sometimes someone will say something, and then that'll, you know, that will inspire Seth, and he'll think of something even funnier. Mm -hmm. And then it's a really crazy creative process, but it's really exciting. But you, I feel like you just want like a certain control. Do you so remember any of the crazy things he had you yell um, out in between the lines? Yeah, but I don't want to ruin the movie for anybody. Well, I guess I can say it because no one's going to know when it's going to come. There's a part where I, <laughs> I insinuate that I eat ass. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 
and literally when they said that I was like wait what <laughs> because they yell it they're like insinuate you eat ass and I'm like okay yeah. <laughs> and so we just gave different versions yeah. so I'm like there I was always insinuating something weird and sexual but that actually made it into the movie and it was like one of those lines that was hard for me to even say without laughing Ugh, I love ass jokes yeah. Eating ass jokes. Eating ass jokes. Look, <laughs> I, groceries are good. I, Not I enjoy eating groceries. Ass. What else is up for you? Like, what's next? What's what's in the line? In July, I'm doing a remake of Flatliners, um, which originally had like Kevin Bacon and Julia Roberts, and so now um, we're remaking it. But yeah. I, I don't. It's not a remake. It's like a a reboot like a refresh yeah. i guess because the movie the original was amazing it just needs to be updated yeah. um and it's like a thriller and i'm gonna go to i believe toronto is where we're filming okay. so i don't know i'm really excited i've never been to toronto toronto's amazing yeah i'm assuming i'll probably end up there a lot because yeah. of my job in the future but i'm excited to go to toronto Super and it's a quick cool. flight yes yeah, quick flight. here you live in new york I don't, uh, but I want to move here. You should definitely move here. And to so I no, I really think that um, when I'm in Toronto, I'm gonna take a couple weekends to come here and look at places. Okay. Yeah. Cool. So well, if anyone's getting rid of their place, hit, let hit, me know. Hit me up. Hit me up. <laughs> Tweet me. Hit me up. I'll definitely show you around. Move, yes. Move to Jersey, like right on the water, so you can get in and out of the city. My right there. grandma lives in Jersey. She lives in Hackensack. Okay. Cool. She's so cute. I love awesome. my grandma. Shout out to Granny. You, you're really cute too. You did an amazing job in Neighbors too. Comes out May 20th. Yeah. Want everybody to go see that. Yeah. We're gonna take some photos of you. Have hey. some fun. <laughs> okay. And uh, it was a great interview. We talked about eating ass, news. Love eating ass. And dick pics. And we love dick pics. We love Kiki Palmer's titties. Yes. Shout yes. out. That was my screensaver. <laughs> I will hit you. <laughs> I'm joking. Join us next week, folks. What we're going to do, we're going to take news and send them to random people unsolicitedly and give them the fear of God.